Yeah, 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 yeah he's leaving, five. he's leaving. Yeah, he's working on Doors 5. Man, he didn't even get on the mic. It's your fault. That was Sean Pluto. It's not my fault. He was playing the whole time. I and mean, I don't know what you were doing. I was playing too. All right, you got it. Anyway, run back. Oh, Training you, partner match. Can you, can you, can you fight the monitor all the time? Everyone else can see but you, man. Everyone else can see but you. Thank you. All right, anyways. Shout out to the human side. <laughs> Please YouTube that legendary video of K9 vs. Kanko if you haven't. Anyway, yeah, these guys play all the time. They know each other's playstyle really well. Like, even outside of knowing each other's playstyle really well, they know the matchup in general really well. So, I. I don't know. It's like when you have two people that know each other like so well, they do things that just maybe they don't make sense to our person. But you know what I mean? You know yeah, what I'm trying yeah, to yeah, say, I, right? I feel you. I feel you. Yeah. But you got to do different things because they know what you're gonna do already. Things you, know? you wouldn't normally do when you're fighting against each other. Yeah, like maybe like it's something like, oh, why would he do that? That's really silly. But he's like, dude, like if I do the thing that I always do, he knows what I'm gonna do. I feel like I'm being redundant here, but you guys know what I'm no, trying yeah. to say. Right? And it's like we've trained each other so hard that we know what we're going to do in the obvious situations here. But it's about pulling out those things that we wouldn't necessarily expect them to take. Good empty hop grab here. Goes for the down throw. Once again, resetting the ledge to an edge to an air. Oh my god. Shield stand up, but Larry gets the grab. Forward throw to push out the advantage. Good that was really good yeah, pressure, yeah, actually. Was. Like, just the corner carry itself and like the safest match on shield. Probably would have killed his was just a little bit off. Oh, he was waiting for anything, like any type of shield drop there. Okay. Oh, man, that's the classic. I Like, fake, like, you fake them out to think that you're going to punch their uh, ledge option, and they just drift back towards the ledge. I don't know. It's uh, A lot of people just drift towards the ledge when they're scared, too, because you want to get that ledge invincibility back. Mm -hmm. But, yeah, Larry saw that really easily. Nice. He's in here for the edge card. Cindy knows he got a lot at 107. I also feel that it's also Cindy who knows like, there's certain things I can't do against Larry that I'll do against Charlie. So yeah. he knows like I play this a little bit differently. I'm just seeing just the way that like Larry approaches this matchup in comparison to Charlie. Like he's I, just he can get in, of course, but he's never forcing anything versus Cindy. Like, no, you not see enough. that he has his lead right now. And he's literally just like I will go stay far enough to where I can react to oh. but. Nice, catching that up smash on the roll in. Larry has been known to have that really good reach. So he knows, I don't have to force anything in. He's bringing it in slowly. Yeah. See what I'm saying? He's holding it onto it as much as possible. He knows I want center stage here, but I can't let Zenyu just see me coming in and approaching him as well. Oh, nice. That on a reaction, nice. too. Man, he just knows that he has so many tools to cover the edge with his character. Like. F tilt could have hit there, up smash could have hit there, down smash hit. Like he just has so many things he can do. Man, oh, okay, two framing on the ledge. Dude, that F tilt has so much range. Like he was like a roll distance away from the ledge and it hit him before he could like even grab the ledge. That's crazy. Man, Wolf four tilt him better than March. Yeah. Yeah. One day they'll buff March. One day. I waited a whole year, man. I see I got nothing but disappointment. Larry not going to disappoint here. So far, he's doing a really good job. He's trying to keep it even. In terms of being neutral here, he's not trying to let go too much. It's dash attack. No up tilt. Up throw. Nice. Continue screen with the platform essential with the up air. It's really good, too, because Larry does push Zenyu, but push, Zenyu pushes back. Oh, oh excuse me. Man. Hold on. I, I just, so I never expected to kill early in this game. Neither did so I. every time I see it kill, even though I've seen it multiple times, I'm always surprised. Oh, I mean, uh, that's what you need when you're Zinni, you try to like get back in this game, you know? I like the way that Larry kind of, like, it's it's pretty risky, because look at how much farther Larry has gone from the ledge, but now he's brought it back towards center stage. He was looking to whip punish Zinni, but he lost a lot of stage control. Slowly brought it back, but now, oh, no attack, no attack. I don't know, man. We saw, dude, we saw Zinni come back against Charlie so heavily in this similar situation. Oh my goodness, he's hitting everything he wants right now. 
And oh, yeah. it's literally from that situation I saw we saw earlier too. Like he let go of a lot of the stage control to try to whiff one of the genuine in the process of he lost the stage here and that's what put Lair in the situation. Wait a minute, save the jump. Oh, oh and no he way, dude. He another says one. every wolf will recover the same, man. Oh my god, Zenyu is two clutches for these edge guards on Wolf today, dude. Same exact thing he did to Charlie. Dude. That was a, such a good comeback, man. Even before the flood, like the way he was getting all those combos on Larry, forcing him to just do unsafe things while he's forcing for the kill. Yeah. He just turned it around. So he's, it's like didn't lose composure even though he's behind so much. I don't know, man. Then you might be back. <laughs> At least in SoCal. And he is going to Frostbite too. So uh, Larry, I think Larry out of like the top five is the one that's not going. Ooh, yeah, Larry is not going. Nico's not going. Charlie is now confirm going as of today. Yeah. Oh wait, now he's not going. He, Charlie is going. Oh okay. So he is as. I'm sorry, I pressed that wrong. Yeah, it's Charlie, Zenyu, Elegant, Master Mario, Boy. I know Carlos is going to as well. A couple other places are not going. Uh, going. But yeah, I was trying to say like, if Zenyu can you know keep up the level of play he's showing right now, um, definitely looking forward to see how he plays that cross play for sure. Like, imagine, like, if we just have all the good Marios doing well instead of just Dark Wizard. Please, please no. That was kind of crazy. Please no. Please no. <laughs> I don't want to watch it. Actually, a lot of the Marios are doing well. Prodigy and Louis Money is like, Mario are doing well, too. Ooh! Oh, shield pressure. Damn, shield's not the best in this game. You can't hold shields forever, my friend. Damn, I've never seen a wolf shield break, actually. Larry's pretty much picking up on this lead really Bro, well. Larry is oppressing him at this ledge. Wow. But then he messed up once and got upset. <laughs> <laughs> yeah, that's what Mario does to you, man. You, uh, you make a mistake here. Oh! oh uh, you hate to see it. That would have been such a good lock. Nice. He finally gets the up on the block where Larry miscommunicating that with the back air. That's what Lizzie was looking at. Cross up that. Uh, see, that's one thing you gotta appreciate about Larry, too, is that he'll take some of these hits and he'll walk away. He won't see a situation where Zenyu tries to punish him afterwards. And Zenyu, uh, that's the thing about Larry, he won't get too greedy. He was not afraid to go for hit and run play style. Yeah. I mean, it definitely helped him out a lot in the previous game. It was just like, once Zenyu started making that comeback, that's when you saw Larry kind of like uncharacteristically start trying to force a lot of kills and play very unsafe. But I don't know if we're going to see Larry fall into that pattern in this game. This is really good neutral right now for Larry. Yep. Combo, of course. I'm gonna try oh, to carry him off stage. The stage. Oh. oh man. If, I, if I'm Larry, like, I, I can jump, but I don't want to jump anywhere near that platform. Oh, imagine, yeah, yeah, you don't. You like, don't. imagine he jumps and then Zine catches his jump looking up there and he's under the platform. Like, so many bad things can happen for him. So close. Oh god. And even then you throw in the direction of air dodge just to avoid that narrow lane. Back throw, resets the uh, edge guard situation. Larry's gonna have to use a double jump. Nice. Comes in with Nair, but he's still fighting to get back to the center stage. That was a really ski Nair from uh, Larry. I'm surprised that you didn't up smash it. I feel like Larry knows. I have to run away with the stock as much as possible. Oh, there the it up is smash. again. Yeah. I feel like that's what Zinni's waiting for. He's waiting for Larry to, uh, to mess up in that one opportunity for an air. And unfortunately, he lost the jump. So he was not gonna be able to come back on the stage. In the process of trying to DI away from any possible combo that I would have gotten, he lost it. Still scary, because Zinni literally brought that same exact situation back in the last game, just from like getting two or three grabs into the edge guard. Oh, yeah. Yeah, it's the fact that he's been so clutch with the, the capes in general today. Like, you never could sleep on him or count him out in the set, but, like, especially now, this, this guy, like, even without comboing you to death, he, he will just, like, straight up take your stock with the easy cape, you know? If you're not, you know, if you're just sleeping on him for a little bit. Oh, wait, hold oh. up. Oh, Larry, please. Okay, save the jump. <laughs> Still, that, that is so scary. Look, I love Sandy. I'm a brewery with you, but I just hate watching Mario win. Why? I just don't like the character. That's just my bias, man. But I will definitely admit it. Zenyu is always been one of the players who just has what it takes to push the character in different directions that other people wouldn't normally see. So seeing him come out in 2020 really strong within these first, within these couple of locals is really good to see. Yeah. Zenyu kind of come back in full action. 
Can you imagine if we had this in a year ago? Like, consistently, like, putting out, like, top three at uh, MSM. Well, see, and that's the thing, too. Like, we did see Jenny for, for a little while in the beginning, but we didn't see another woman. And then, for the rest of, like, I would, well, I would want to say, like, a solid nine months, we only saw Zenyu, like, have a few of them, and that's it. Yeah, yeah. Oh! Oh, nice. Put someone in there, pushing him off the stage. Yeah, I don't know, man. Larry was, like, so confident when it comes to going off stage and stacking the jump with Wolf. Second dash stack pushing the stage. Oh. oh. Uh, I don't think he was expecting Larry to, like, do an unsafe Wolf Flash there. Because yeah. if he was, that was, like, a free, like, F smash on that. Larry also shooting things up. Not going to call for the down throw. But I'm going to throw throw instead. Nice. See what I'm talking about? He's not afraid to get his hit. Walk away, and at this opportunity, what Larry's looking for is a whip punish, and then he senses it, but he wants to catch him with the with an anti-air because he knows Larry might be going for a neutral air. Mm -hmm. nice. Oh man! Instead, he gets anti-aired himself. Clean up smash out of shield for Larry. And uh, I don't know, man. I don't want to see it, but this might be the time when Mario just starts swinging for the kill. Yeah. And that's Larry's like the last person you want to try that strategy against. Oh, he will definitely. literally just wait for you to swing. Oh! oh I mean, he didn't even let him wait to get down the no ledge. No time to breathe whatsoever. As soon as he saw him exactly where he wanted him off stage in that lower quadrant, just spike him for good measure, man. Call crazy. me crazy. But Free every stock, dude. Yeah. I had a thought. I just lost it. Never mind. Don't worry about it. Uh, but like you said, right, like, I think it was a lot of opportunity that Larry kind of slowly started bringing what was happening in the last few games where I take a couple hits and then I push advantage, just get stage control, sacrifice a little bit of it just to force Zenny to go for an option. Yeah. And then this one time that Zenny did not get an anti-air, that's where Larry slowly took it away. Let's see here what happens in game four. I really like how Larry is, like, spacing around Mario. Like, he knows Mario has poor range, and he's using all, like, the advantages of Wolf's hitboxes to the fullest. Yeah. And even if he's not throwing out hitboxes, he's staying a far enough distance on the stage where Zingu just doesn't get free openings against him, you know? Yeah. That's, like, the one one thing I'm just noticing from Larry in comparison to the Charlie match. When it comes out to the air-to-air, -air, though, Zenyu is always on the That's the thing, too. He's not afraid to go for up He's not afraid to go to down air. And then try to beat out Larry in that situation. So I feel like where Larry wins here is when he gets those quick combos, gets away, and then waits for Zenyu to come into the air. Throw throw, nice. Changing things up here. Not going for down throw. I feel like Zenyu is, is pretty off uh, Pretty cautiously good DI for down throw and not forward throw. Yeah. He has to have good DI on fourth throw too though. Like he's not going on the ground where it's wolf can freely oh. take. Hey! Wolf Larry goes for the wolf fire a lot too. Fortunately for him, he's not gonna kill. Wait. How are you gonna get play? Oh yeah, it doesn't have that much energy like, but yeah. the jump gets caught. Another reverse of Smash Bros. See, if Zenyu is not oh. there for the air to air with Larry, he's always going to be there for the air to air. But when it comes out to the air to air, what Larry tries to do is call him out with back air, last air, wait for the landing. Yeah, that's where Larry's accelerating here. Miss grab, nice. Bringing it back to with the last air. And the way that Larry gets in with dash attack, he can get a picture with another dash attack. So I know Larry's always looking to see how that situation plays out with the run and gun. Nice seat, backs out. Back on the platform, Larry on the hunt gets a, a cross up. Yeah, Larry's like, I'm just trying to jump out of this combo as oh, best I can. No, but, oh, in. yeah, yeah. Zinyu was ready with the pivot grab too. Oh my goodness. Alright. Larry's gonna say more towards the stage, and he knows it too. Can't really push up a tree. No dash attack? No, nice. nice. Tech roll. So good at getting these techniques from down throw, man. Oh, opportunity. Oh, nice. Right the jump. Break and there? The ledge. Yeah, and then there man. In. Larry dude. Takes the stock. What, what good awareness from Larry, dude. He turned that one neutral win to option for stock. He was so far behind, but unsafe on the shield. He's going to immediately answer back with the up smash. And uh, yeah, this, he's going so close. Like, even when Larry somehow is getting these, like, oh. stocks. Zenyu is just not getting flustered, really. Yeah. Stay, keeping his head in the game. But, 
Larry, though, has him exactly where he wants him. I was scared for a second nice. there. Got the ledge jump. Three. Oh, no. Oh, no I, thought that was, I thought that was it until before he catches the ground. But yeah, same, same. Wait. Still really good for Larry. Oh. That was good. It's the fact that he's still keeping pressure here, but I'm really, really more confident on seeing Larry get on reaction. We saw that. Oh. No, we're no. living. Oh, my God. Full screen. Oh, man. That was so good for him. The coin egg and neck. Oh, man. Being hanging on by a thread. Larry's still at a I want to see. This is the thing where Larry excels more on reaction here. I like it backs off. And he caught the bump at the back in a down smash. It's the reaction that he had towards Zenny, too. Ooh. That's what I'm saying. That's where Larry has.